the Shunammites land restored. Now Elijah said, uh, Elijah had said to the woman whose son he had restored to life, go away with your family and stay for a while wherever you can, because the Lord has decreed a famine in the land that will last seven years. The woman um, proceeded to do as the man of God said. She and her family went away and stayed in the land of the Philistines seven years. At the end of the seven years, she came back from the land of the Philistines and went to the king to beg for her house and land. The king was talking to Gehazi, the servant of the man of God, and, and had said, Tell me about all the great things Elijah has done. Just as Gehazi was telling the king, now Elijah had restored the dead to life, the woman whose son Elijah had brought back to life came to beg the king for her house and land. Gehazi said, This is the woman, my lord, the king, and this is her son, whom Elijah restored to life. The king asked the woman about it, and she told him. So, interesting. So, Gehazi was talking to the king and uh, telling him already about this, the woman that um, is now there, and there she is, right? She's there with her son. Let's continue to read. Gehazi said, this is the woman, my lord, the king, and this is her son, whom Elijah restored to life. The king asked the woman about it, and she told him. Then he assigned an official to her case and said to him, Give back everything that belonged to her, including all the income from her land, from the day she left the country until now. So, um, basically, at this time, um, things were going a little bit better because, again, the lord was protecting Israel, right? And so she had came back and more than likely they just kind of started utilizing her area, her land and her house because it was empty or maybe somebody else took over or something, but now, or the kingdom, you know, the kingdom took it. And so now um, she's getting it back and is able to get it back. That's another blessing, right? Think about those things. Um, in our lives um, when things happen for us and things can get restored for us too right think about those things how does it make uh, what kind of thoughts or feelings come to your mind when we read over this portion how does it make you feel and what does it make you think